Leslie Patterson was the world's most wanted person 11 months ago. The five-time world champion triathlete was the talk of Hollywood when All Quiet on the Western Front, the film she helped adapt for the big screen, took home four Oscars, including Best Foreign Film. A record seven BAFTAs were won by the first World War picture, including Best Film and Best Adapted Screenplay. However, Ms. Patterson's aspirations of becoming a Hollywood star were abruptly dashed at the close of the previous year upon the discovery that her spouse, Dr. Simon Marshall, a sports psychologist, had stage 4 pancreatic cancer. The couple, who relocated to California to pursue their passion for movies full-time, pledged on Instagram to overcome the heartbreaking diagnosis. Ms. Patterson said, 2023 was filled with the biggest of bigs, the highest of highs, the lowest of lows. From BAFTA victories to Oscar nominations and triumphs, Simon sadly received a pancreatic cancer diagnosis. Thus, we will be facing the greatest battle of our life in 2024. We will require your positive energy, so keep it coming. Dr. Marshall continued, even though late-stage pancreatic cancer is never nice, we're going to beat it and I've got the world champ and hustler extraordinaire on my side and, on average, we're doing fine. From launching new careers and moving to LA and embarking on this incredible journey we've both been on now in film, Dr. Marshall said. Sterling native Ms. Patterson, 43, gained international attention when she revealed that it took her 16 years to secure an agreement to adapt Eric Maria Remarque's 1929 book for the big screen. In 1930, a Hollywood film based on the book took home the Best Picture Oscar. When Ms. Patterson first met Ian Stokel, her writing partner, she was a professional athlete and jobbing actor. She then sought Remarque's estate to obtain the rights to recreate the movie for a contemporary audience. The triathlete committed more than £165,000 over the course of 16 years to purchase the film rights, using the money she won during a race in Costa Rica that she entered despite having a damaged shoulder. Finally, her wish came true when Netflix decided to produce the film in German. Daniel Brohl and Felix Kammer starred in the film, which became a commercial and critical hit. As a result, Ms. Patterson and her English husband, whom she met during their time as students at Loughborough University, moved to Los Angeles full-time. They were on top of the world after their Oscar and BAFTA wins, an insider claimed. They were at last pursuing their passion, receiving offers to make movies, and everything appeared perfect, then, Simon received a diagnosis of one of the worst malignancies in November of last year. A GoFundMe campaign has been started by the couple to raise $500,000 for experimental treatment. Leslie said on the GoFundMe page, My husband Simon and I are currently facing the greatest test of our lives. Life has a way of challenging us with unexpected obstacles. Inspired by the unshakable spirit that has shaped our lives, we are committed to overcoming this enormous obstacle, this illness upset our plans and had an emotional, physical, and financial impact on us just as Simon was about to embark on an incredible new chapter in his career. The usual care options available for pancreatic cancer can be relatively limited in their effectiveness, despite the fact that we are lucky to have excellent insurance. We are investigating novel and cutting-edge therapies, methods, and treatments in an effort to achieve the greatest potential result. These innovative methods provide promise, but they are not without expense. We need the assistance of our amazing community, our friends and family who have always stood by us through thick and thin, as we strive to defeat this unrelenting foe. By Friday night, $117,000 had been added to the fund.